I want to talk about if this device here is your friend or your foe. Lots of clients base their day on the number that comes up on this scale. And so they'll have a good day if the scale is a good number or if the number that comes up is not what they're expecting, it will cloud and color their entire day. So I really wanna take the power out of this machine because guess what? Weight is not the best measurement of success in your fitness and fat loss journey. It's only one measure and not even the best measure of success when you're taking care of your health. You get on the scale and you feel like, well, nothing is happening. I'm never gonna lose weight, but guess what? Your body is taking care of itself things will happen and sometimes it's happening below the surface and it takes a bit of time for it to get reflected on the scale. So I want to set you up for success, make a mental note or write it down of the non-scale victories that you're feeling before you get on the scale. Things like I have more energy, I'm stronger in my workouts, I can carry the groceries with with ease, I'm going up and down the stairs like nothing. I'm feeling more confident. These things are important and if not more important than what that number says, but if that number comes up and it's not the number that you want, lots of times we discount all those other positive benefits of the healthy habits that we've adopted. And then it gets discouraging and hard to, to stay the course. So I just want to uh, help you detach your self-worth and your mood on the based on the number on the scale. I do like to get on the scale daily or every second day because it helps you connect the dots between your behaviors, your nutrition, your workouts, and what's happening. It helps you really get to know your body in terms of what happens when I'm having my period, what happens when I have a heavier carb meal, what happens when I haven't drunk enough water, what happens when I've maybe had a couple drinks. If the number really does a head case on you, maybe you're not gonna get on it, maybe you're gonna use other ways to measure your success. For example, like inches, your strength, how your clothes fit, how you look in the mirror. Those are important too. So let's take the power out of this machine and empower ourselves. Remembering that this is not the boss of, of you, you are the boss of you.